My name is Farhad Beg, and I'm professor of engineering physics at the Department of Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering at the University of California, San Diego. I work in high energy density physics, and this is the extreme state of matter. And this state occurs in stars, uh, in planets. So what I do is to create stars and the planet-like condition in the laboratory. Thermonuclear fusion provides, or can provide, limitless energy. Uh, and you know the energy we are getting from the sun is due to uh, fusion. There are few advantages of thermonuclear fusion. Uh, one advantage is that you don't produce uh, significant nuclear waste. You can say it's a lot more clean energy. The second thing is that you use lighter nuclei, so you can use water as a fuel if you uh, like to create deuterium or treaty. Seepint is basically, you have two electrodes in the tube, you fill with the gas, and when you apply the voltage, the breakdown takes place in the gas, and the current starts to flow. So if the current is flowing uh, in axial direction, then you generate self-generated magnetic field in azimuthal direction. That interaction of magnetic field and the current produces J cross P force, which pinches it to the axis to high densities and temperatures. When you're using pulse power Z pinches, you can produce large volume uh, plasma. So that's the advantage, uh, advantage of pulse power Z pinches. You are dealing with kilojoule or more than kilojoule energies in large volume. I started uh, my career or I got interested in uh, thermonuclear fusion. Now we are getting very close, so definitely that excites me. So I tell my students, if you want to change the world, this is what you want to do. <laughs>